Hey guys, last week I posted a video to help you figure out how much protein you need to consume in your daily menu. This week I am actually doing a part two where I am going to let you know all of the actual purposes of protein, the dangers of too much protein, and the dangers of too little protein. So if you need help with your nutritional information, then keep watching. The purpose of protein, most people just think in their mind that it is for building muscle tissue, but it really does have a lot of other biological functions for our bodies. Um, we've got cell growth, repair and maintenance. Um, it acts as enzymes and enables chemical reactions in the body. Um, it acts as a hormone to return the body to a normal condition. It helps to maintain fluid and electrolyte balance, which allows for proper body function. It helps to maintain your acid base levels, which helps to keep your respiratory and metabolism working properly. It helps to boost your immune system by producing antibodies. It provides energy when needed. It, however, is not taken from a store within your body like a carbohydrate or fat would be. It is actually pulled directly from your bloodstream or unfortunately will go in to start breaking down your body tissues to use that protein. It will help in assisting transport and storage of nutrients. It helps to make neurotransmitters, uh, blood clotting to seal a wound, um, and then scar tissue to heal a wound. The dangers of too much protein. High blood cholesterol contribute to bone loss, increase risk of kidney disease. If you are too low on your protein, there are two main diseases that come with that. Marasmus and Quashiorcor. Uh, these two things are what you might picture when you see the Ethiopian children on the TV. So the Marasmus is gonna be closely related to the child that looks completely malnourished. It is a gross, inadequate level of protein. You can see skin and bones, you can see no energy. They're just laying there. They're not crying. They're not doing anything. The quashior core is going to be the child that's a little bit older, maybe, with the big belly on them. Well, that just means that it's an inadequate level of protein in their daily intake. And so most likely they were weaned off of their mother's milk too early. I hope you guys found that information useful and it gives you a little more insight on the purpose of protein and why we need it. If you guys have any questions, concerns, comments, suggestions, ideas, or if you need help with your nutrition, please go ahead and reach out by putting a comment in the comment section below or by contacting me directly through my Facebook or Instagram. For those people that have subscribed, thank you very much, I really appreciate it. And for those of you who have not subscribed, please consider doing so. Anyways, I really hope you guys have a great week and I will see you next Monday. Bye.